Hello guys. Welcome to my video, introduce my name is Gifari, from the University Sam Ratchalanji Information Systems Study Program. Alright, on this occasion I will explain about graph theory material. What is graph? A graph is a basic object of learning in graph theory. In everyday language, a graph is a set of objects called points, vertices, or angles connected by connectors called lines or sides. In the qualified graph, which is usually not directed, a line from point A to point B is considered to be the same as a line from point B to point A. In directed graph, the line has a direction. Basically, a graph depicted in the form of a diagram as a set of points, angles or vertices, combined with curves, lines or sides. Yes, model in a graph, production process. An example of the graph model in the production process is cross-production planning by analyzing the conditions of the production line based on the standard time of each operation. Problems will arise if there is a buildup of material in one or several operations on the track, so the production process becomes inefficient. In describing the problem, use directed graph model specifically known as the network. To solve the problem of material buildup, a line balancing method pounds is used. The procedure is carried out by combining two or more operations in such a way as workstations, so that the time between stations is relatively the same. Next step is to evaluate the level of track efficiency after the results of grouping operations. Path and distance in graph. In the mathematical field of graph theory, the distance between two vertices in a graph is the number of edges in the shortest path, also called a graph geodesic, connecting them. This is also known as the geodesic distance. Notice that there may be more than one shortest path between two vertices. If there is no path connecting the two vertices, if they belong to different connected components, then conventionally the distance is defined as infinite. In the case of a directed graph the distance d, u, v between two vertices u and v is defined as the length of a shortest directed path from u to v consisting of arcs, provided at least one such path exists. Notice that, in contrast with the case of undirected graphs, d, u, v does not necessarily coincide with d, v, u, and it might be the case that one is defined while the other is not. Hamiltonian path. In a graph there is such a thing as Hamiltonian. Hamilton's path is the path through each vertex in the graph exactly once. If the trajectory returns to the original vertex to form a closed path, then the closed path is called the Hamilton circuit. In other words, the Hamilton circuit is a circuit that goes through each vertex in the graph exactly once, except for the original vertex, which is traversed twice. A graph that has a Hamilton circuit is called a Hamiltonian graph, whereas a graph which only has a Hamiltonian path, is called a semi-Hamiltonian graph. That's the explanation of the material about graph theory, starting from what it is graphs, graphs of the production process graph, roads and distances, and the path of Hamilton. More and less we apologize.